All right, welcome to the receiving bay of our West plan. Just to preface this, we are in a fabrication shop. So as we walk through, sorry, you're gonna hear some noise. There will probably be fork trucks running. There's going to be welders welding, grinders grinding, guys listening to music, because our guys got soul. Over here, we're gonna talk about the stuff that we receive in from our trucks. Trucks come in, they drop off shipments here. We've got pallets that are set up for each unique fan. So your pallet is going to contain all the steel required to put your fan together. Some of the steel is going to come in on trucks. Some of it's already here in raw form. Over here, we've got pallets set up specifically for different jobs that we're currently manufacturing. Over here is where we keep a lot of our stock products. So we've got things like access doors that'll go on your housing bearing bars that'll go on your pedestal, wheel spinnings over here. Out in this lean-to, we've got inlet spinnings that'll go on the inlet of your fan that'll turn the air as it comes into the fan. This is our raw material over here to the left. So we've got flat bar, angle iron, channel. It's being cut to size for the specific fans on our jobs. So the first of our two production facilities largely specializes in wheel building. So all of these fabricators over here are welding wheels. So as we head back into some of these bays, we'll show you some of the wheels that are currently being built. Mind if we check out your wheel for a second? So as we get in a little bit closer, you can see he's close to the finished product. All he has left to do on this wheel is put the shroud up here and weld the shroud continuously to these blade edges. So, let's talk about our quality for a minute. All of our welders are certified to the AWS D14.6 standard. That's reflected in the quality you see on this wheel. No, we did not tell him we were gonna come by and check out his wheel. We just randomly stopped in. This one's gonna be completed soon. We'll head that way in our shop to look at some that are already completed and go to the balance station. So these are our balance machines where every single wheel that we manufacture is going to go through its first round of dynamic balancing. So we're going to balance the wheel on a shaft and do a two-plane balance here. Now, the minimum requirement for our balance department is to meet a G6.3 spec. So when they come over to their station here, they're going to log into their job find out the maximum imbalance that they can get through their wheel when they actually balance it, find out the minimum speed that it has to run at. When you're doing just a wheel balance like this and you're running it at one sixth of the operating speed as a minimum. So they're then going to mount the wheel like this one is and we're going to run it through a series of spins. So we're going to use our balance equipment over here, our pickup points on the back of this and on the back of this plane over here as well. Those pickup points are going to pick up amplitude of imbalance that's in the wheel while it's operating. We're going to figure out how much weight needs to get added at different points. And once we're set on how much weight needs to get added, we're going to completely weld these balance weights on both sides. Then we're going to go through a few more runs just to get the wheel down to as minimum imbalance as possible before we ship it over to the other facility to be put together with the complete fan. So this closes our tour of the West production facility. We're gonna head over to the North plant to see the complete fans getting put together. Welcome to our North facility. So this is the second facility that we manufacture in. They're about eight miles apart. We're standing in front of the receiving bay right now. So we're going to start our tour here in the receiving bay. Right over here is the shipping bay and we'll end up there. We've got motor slide bases. We have bushings over here. We've got shaft cooling discs, cooling wheels, shaft coolers, heat slingers. It's all the same thing. They're right there. Over here, we have motors. And then against this wall, we have pallets that are specific to the job. So the drive components are all assembled on one pallet specific to their job. So we'll have a motor, a shaft, bearings, maybe a coupling, maybe belts, depending on the drive. So let's head this way. I'm warning you, it's gonna be loud. It's a production facility. We're currently trim balancing a fan. We walked past the sign back there that said AirPro is 100% employee owned. 
That's true of every employee that you see in this facility. We're all owners here, which means everyone has to do their part to make sure they're doing their job to grow the company that they're a part owner of. Starting here in the very back of the facility, this is our high bay where we're manufacturing and putting together complete fans. Over here is our blast booth. So fans that maybe need an epoxy coating or a polyurethane or maybe a special material that needs to be bead blasted is done in that booth. Over here, we're gonna go into our paint booth, our first of two paint booths. These two pressure pots over here is where we do all of our mixing. So the mixing is done in there. We load it typically with our standard dark charcoal gray color, but we can mix any color specifically to your job if needed. The paint booth is over here. This is a pressurized paint booth. Right now it's open so we can see inside it. But many times when this is closed, it's actually pressurized and sealed so that if you came and opened the door, it would shut down our booth. So we have lines over here that are running through the wall into the paint booth and that's how they're spraying all the fans. So we'll head back out of the booth here. So we saw a bunch of wheels getting welded at the West facility. Here at the North facility, we're putting together housing, pedestals, and they're all being welded back here. He's currently working on a housing here. So he's tack welded it together and now he's laying the, yeah, he's laying the fillet weld. So we'll continue to move along. Now we're going from our high bay into more manufacturing over here. And this is where the fans are going to start moving into assembly. So now we're starting to see the fans completely come together. So here's a completed fan. This is carbon steel, has yet to be painted. So the, the fan is first going to go through the SP1, SP2, SP3 cleaning process, which is standard before it moves into the paint booth. So all of these fans over here, they're all awaiting paint right now. So these are carbon steel fans going to be moved into paint. So this is a partially assembled fan. You can see the pie split housing has come together up there. We have bearings that have just been installed within the last hour. We've got a shaft in the bearings. The motor has yet to be mounted over here. There will be a coupling on this one because it's an arrangement eight fan. On this side, we're going to be mounting the wheel on the shaft in there. And because of the extended unitary base, we can tell there's going to be an inlet box that'll come off of the unitary base that will then mount onto the inlet of that specific fan. There's two more trim balancing stands here. Where we're going to bolt fans down in these trim balancing racks. And we're gonna run those fans at full operating speed before we ever ship them off to our customer. So the fans that we're about to see in the finished product over here, the shipping bay, they've all been through this entire cycle. Everything you've seen from the back of the shop through the paint booth being welded back there, assembled over here, trim balanced over here. We're going to see the finished product move into the shipping bay. So all of these fans are being prepped for shipment right now. That involves several QC checks that our inspectors over here go through. They're going to go and they're going to make sure the fan is perfect. It's exactly what you ordered. It looks exactly how you would expect it to look when you receive it. They're putting the finishing touches on. And then a truck's going to come in here. We're going to load the fans onto the truck and ship them off to the facility. Getting the fans out on time. We're standing in the shipping bay. We have a 95% on-time shipment requirement that our shop is required to meet, and we do meet it. Also, safety. Up there on a screen that we can't see right now, but there's TV screens mounted through our facilities, indicates the time it's been since our last lost time accident. Currently, on September 2nd, 2020, that number sets at 634 days. We take safety seriously here. We have banners hanging on the walls in both of our facilities showing our three-year warranty. It's not just a big fan like this that gets the three-year warranty. Every product you've seen as we've gone through this facility tour, you've seen the attention to detail we put in, the quality that we require of all of our employees. Three-year warranty is standard to AirPro, and we're set apart in the industry having that three-year warranty. From the smallest fans over there the biggest fans over here, we're going to give you the product that you're expecting every time.
So hopefully you've enjoyed our tour as we walk out the doors here. So this wraps up our tour. Thank you so much for coming along. Hope you enjoyed getting to see some of our employees as they were at work. Hope you enjoyed looking at the different fans as we were building them. Hopefully next time we can actually do this live and in person. See you later.